wetlands of the Upper Texas coast provide critical habitat for fish, wildlife, plants, and insects. But coastal erosion and sea level rise threaten this ecosystem. The challenge is to assemble a network of people. You know, five and six right now. A team that can cooperate and contribute towards the goal of restoring and protecting the marsh. That's where Mike Resitech comes in. When I saw the condition of the marshes around here, what I wanted to do was work towards restoring them to maybe not what we had 100 years ago, but maybe something that could support itself for fish and wildlife and recreational use. But you can't do it all by yourself. You've got to have partners. Ducks Unlimited and Texas Parks and Wildlife have a long history of cooperatively working together towards conservation. Keeping it out of the weather saves wear and tear on these bearings here. Ducks Unlimited provides some engineering and on-the-ground expertise to match the wildlife management objectives that the department has. From rebuilding marshes with dredge material to protecting them with rock walls, I'm going to give you a brief overview Mike is transforming his vision of a restored marsh into reality. There's just no way to do a project this big for one agency or even two agencies. We've got to have partners. The private industry has the resource. In this case, it's the dredge material. Parks and Wildlife and Ducks Unlimited had the expertise. So for those, those unfamiliar with the project, Golden Pass needed to dredge their berth. Mike is comfortable in a school group. Basically, all we did was Mike's comfortable in a group of uh, businessmen. Really with a substantial cost savings to them. He's comfortable at the city council or the county commissioner's court. We've got a really nice marsh. And it's that ability to find a way to communicate with people at all those levels that makes him the linchpin in developing partnerships. That's where the old surface was. That result in habitat restoration. We make that decision and move forward. And put conservation on the ground. And then we learn from what we've done. The Murphy staff here and, and Mike have, have a vision for what they want to see on the landscape. It's not project by project. It's a long-term perspective. My philosophy is, is kind of expressed by a very wise man named Anonymous. Think of all the great things we can do if we don't worry who gets the credit. I didn't do this by myself. Everybody that works with me is part of this. We've got a lot of work left to do, and I don't care who gets the credit. I want everybody to come together and work towards a common goal. We can worry about doing the credit later. Let's get the marsh restored first.